Hello everyone. In this lecture, we will study an example to calculate the input referred thermal noise voltage. We are calculating the input referred thermal noise voltage of this amplifier shown in figure below. Here we have used two transistor M1 and M2. Okay. So representing the thermal noise of an M1 and M2 by a current source. Noting that they are uncorrelated, we can write it as this is of I n one square and this is by I n two square, and the resistance will be R not one in parallel with R two. There is no other resistor shown over here, and the thermal noise is simply given by four k t two by three or gamma g m one plus gamma g m two two by three again R not one in parallel with R not two whole square. And the voltage gain in this case is given by G M one, R not one in parallel with R not two, and the total noise voltage referred to the gate of M one can be given by this can be simply calculated as V M in square is equals to V M out square upon the gain. So dividing both of these terms, what we get dividing by the gain square, what we get. We will get 4 kT 2 by 3 GM1 plus 2 by 3 GM2 upon 1 by GM1 square. Okay, solving it further, we will get 4 kT. We can take gamma here out of the bracket, common in both of these terms, or we can write 4 kT 2 by 3 GM1 plus 3 GM2 upon GM1 whole square. And it reveals that the dependence of this input referred voltage. Upon GM1 and GM2, this input referred voltage is directly proportional to the transconductance of M2 transistor, and it is inversely proportional to the transconductance of M1 transistor. Okay, so it confirms that GM2 must be minimized. The, the transconductance of this transistor must be minimized because this uh, M2 serves as a current source, and the transconductance of M1 can be increased to decrease this input referred noise. Okay, so this is a simple example which shows that how input referred thermal noise voltage of the amplifier and how we can control the input referred thermal noise voltage by the transconductance of the Transistors. In the next lecture, we will study about common gate stage and how we can design common source stage with low noise operation. Thank you.